So this is a project of mine that I've been working on in the background for a few years at this point. The objective being to use my 3D printing and design skills to try to make the best helmet system I could for playing airsoft in. This all started with just the mask section, which uses a set of ESS goggles with a clip-on paintball shell. The goggles are ballistically rated to stop actual shotgun pellets, so make for some excellent eye pro for airsoft. So aside from painting the shell NATO green to better blend into foliage, we get to the first custom parts that really make this project shine. Cable tied to a series of holes drilled into the paintball shell is the grill that protects my teeth. This entire piece I designed and 3D printed in a tough copolymer of nylon and TPE, named PCTPE. It's flexible enough to conform to the shape of the shell, while also being tough enough to be impenetrable by BBs shot even at the point blank range. So this is the part that has gone through the most iterations to get right. Another custom part is this 5 volt fan mount that blows air onto the inside of the goggle lens, removing the fogging issue with goggles that we've all had bad experiences with. This is powered by this battery pack situated on the back of the helmet, which is just cable tied to the goggle strap. This box has had some mods done to it as well. The waterproof battery boxes I used here are great, but had a low profile switch on them, which was really hard to toggle when wearing gloves. I fixed this by drilling out the original switch, and installing this nicely tactile flip switch in its place, which works really well. The box can be unplugged from the fan, the connector is hilariously overkill for this use case, but it's just what I had lying around at the time. So the actual helmet uses a generic Mitch helmet replica, which has some pretty decent padding on the inside. The helmet in particular looks pretty cool with the rest of my gear, and has a profile which the goggles nicely match up with. It also protects my noggin a bit from getting shot in the head and ears, as well as bumping into things. Then lastly, to keep the goggles cinched up to my face, I made this latch which is bolted onto the helmet and the mask shell that allows me to hook the mask onto the helmet. In the event that the goggle strap were to be caught or break, the mask wouldn't fall off my face. It also improves the fit of the system on my head and turns the two parts into a combined unit. The mask section is still easily removable if I want to take it on or off. This was inspired by looking at pressurised flight helmets like the one pictured. I've used the setup for a while now, and although it's always going to be a work in progress, I thought I'd show it off here. So that's about it, thanks for watching the video. Any questions about the design or anything else, let me know in the comments. Check out some of my older videos as well, for more 3D printing and design content if you're interested in this kind of thing. There'll hopefully be more videos on the way soon. See ya.